Hey, I'm Brody Smith. Uh, I just wrapped up a session here in Nashville with Minel Symbols and Minel Stick and Brush. And I just wanted to run you through my setup real quick. So we'll start with Symbols, of course. I've got the uh, Byzance Medium Traditional Hi-Hats. I've used these for almost a year now. Um, definitely the nicest hi-hats I've ever played. I've also used the uh, Pure Alloy Medium Hi-Hats, which I also like a lot. I don't know, these are just a lot smoother when they're open and the stick attack when they're closed is maybe almost as good as the pure alloys. Um, so I don't know, they're just a really well-rounded hi-hat and I pretty much always use these. And then over here we've got the uh, Pure Alloy Custom Medium Heavy Crash and it's an 18 inch. And then I've also got another Pure Alloy Custom Crash over here but it's just a medium. But they're both 18s, so medium heavy on the left, just medium on the right. And I like these because they're definitely brighter and some crashes, but not too harsh. Um, and they're pretty durable too, they're not too thin. Um, earlier today we were also using the uh, Byzance traditional medium crash 18 and then a medium thin 19 on the right. Um, and I like those a lot too because they're darker, um, but they still cut enough for metal stuff. They're not too dry or anything. So yeah, those are the crashes. Then I've got a, a Classics Custom 10 inch splash which is just a good splash, especially for the money. I've used this exact splash for years. Um, and yeah, I don't know, it just sounds great. It just cuts right through. And I like 10 inches a lot because they just fit nicely in my kit setup. Uh, and then I got the 22 inch uh, Pure Alloy Medium ride. This is a cool ride because I wouldn't say like it's a ride that you would crash on, like holding quarter notes crashing on it, but the crash isn't so overwhelming that it's like, I don't know, that it like doesn't shimmer at all. Because um, at home I have the 22 inch um, heavy hammered ride, the Byzance Brilliant one. And uh, that's like the perfect ride for really heavy metal stuff. Like the bell sounds amazing, but you like don't crash on that cymbal. Um, so that's what I like about this one is there's still plenty of stick attack on top and on the bell, but I can still like maybe like on a big downbeat I'll crash on this and I like that a lot. And then we've got the uh, Artist Concept Model Thomas Lang Super Stack, which is sick. It just sounds kind of like how you want a metal stack to sound like. And uh, it sounds good when you have it really tight, but it also sounds really good when you loosen, up, loosen it up a bit. And it's great for the money. It's the Classics Custom Series, and yeah, it's just a great stack. I've got the Classics Custom 18-inch Dark China, which I like a lot. Just like the Splash and the stack for the money, it's just a great China. and. I don't know, it just does what, what you want a china to do. If you're playing metal, it just cuts really well, but it's not like so papery that it like gets out of the way instantly. Earlier, before we brought this one in, I was using the Classics Custom Dual China, which maybe I like the most. I love both chinas a lot. Um, that one kind of is a little bit more papery. It sounds like just a really classic, quick china sound, but it's, I don't know, it still cuts really well, and I, I like it a lot. So both of those chinas are sick. Minel stick and brush, I use the Heavy 2B model. Um, I hit really, really hard, and I hit a lot of rim shots on the snare. So having a bigger stick is good for two reasons. One, it's more durable, because if you're hitting hard rim shots, you're gonna break sticks. Um, but also, I think it sounds a lot better for when you're playing powerfully. You know, you want to really like lay into the toms, lay into the rim shots, and having a big stick like, I mean, I'm still working for it, but it does some of the work for you, you know? It gets a lot of tone out of the drums. So yeah, I've always used something at least similar to a 2B, and I love the heavy 2Bs that Monel makes. But yeah, thanks for checking it out. Thanks, Monel. That's it.